Good morning. This is Debbie with the Food Prepping Channel. And this morning I'm going to do a review. Um, I'm always, because I'm handicapped, because I cook on my kitchen table, I'm always looking for new gadgets that I can put on my kitchen table to cook with. And, of course, I use my new wave more than I use anything else. It's over there. Um, I use it more than anything else. But there's certain things, pans, that will not work on the new wave. So, I saw this little rival stove, I mean, burner at Walmart. It was $10. Um, I had to get it. I, I have... I think they used to be called hot plates or something like that. I don't know. I've never had one before, and I had never seen one before. And with it being $10, I had to try it out because, like this pan right here, this is my awesome Paula Dean pan that I haven't used but one time. And this little thing, I've got the cord under it now, but this little thing has the... Um, it doesn't move. It's, you know, it's got the rubber um, tips on the bottom of it, so it doesn't move. It goes up to, goes maximum five, four, three, two, one. Well, we're going to try it out and see because I want to, I'm going to just make some French toast and see how it works on here. And when you, of course, when you turn it on, the light comes on. It's rival. It's a Walmart item because it's got the Walmart sticker on the bottom of it telling what it is. And I threw the box away like a dummy. But I'm going to fix some French toast. So we're going to see how this works. And I've got some eggs here. <laughs> and I don't know if you can see or not. But I put cinnamon and milk in here. And I put a ton of cinnamon because I love cinnamon French toast. So this is the first time I've used this and it doesn't look like it's heating up very fast. Well, I don't know. It's got steam coming out of it, so maybe it is. And I've just got shed spread, country crock shed spread. Um, I call it shed spread. It's mainly water is what it is. It's margarine, but it's got a lot of water in it um, so I've got it in the bottom of this pan and like I said I've got so many pans that I can't use because the new wave requires the, a certain type of pan which I have all the pans for it and stuff that I can use with it but I still have a lot that I can't use so we're gonna try this out and see if it works it's definitely heating it up. Not quite as fast as my new wave, but um, this is also a big pan, too. But I still think I will be able to use it. And I'm kind of excited about this because I'm always, I mean, being handicapped is hard. Especially when you don't have an eat-in kitchen and everything that I have is here in my dining room, which is right next to my I've got it partitioned off I don't know if you let me see if I can get it I've got it partitioned off to buy a shelf there and it's got a lot of my um, kitchen gadgets on it and everything is right here in my dining room for me to cook on and so I with this I at least can and look at it see it's it's definitely turning hot. It's definitely getting hot. Alright, so. And another thing I wanted to show y'all. This is kind of a review of the. This is Sara Lee. Let me see if I can get it up here. Whole grain white bread. I don't know why, but I just have a thing. I don't like, well, whole grain bread. Because of the looks of it because it's like a brown color and I just don't like that for some reason so we're gonna I'm gonna move this over here so we can see all right I'm gonna put the 
And what I do with the... Oh my gosh, this piece is going to hit. This took all of the cinnamon. This one piece has got all of the cinnamon on it. But you can hear it bubbling, sizzling, whatever. And I just dip the the bread and the egg and the milk and the cinnamon and then put it in the pan. And of course I'm fixing some for Kathy too. She'll be here and the kids will probably want some. I had to put some more cinnamon in here because it's definitely a lot of cinnamon on these two pieces right here. And it doesn't look like it's heating up very fast. But I still think that I'll be... Well, maybe it... I don't know. This pan I haven't used very much, so it's still got the good non-stick coating on it. Oh, yeah, it's, it's doing good. It is. Let's see. I'm going to flip this piece. It's got so much cinnamon on it. Oh, yeah, it's definitely working. Definitely. So, I'm going to fix this and get the um, French toast fixed. And let me back it up here so you, can, you all can see it. It's just a little rival hot plate or <laughs> an eye mics on the stove and it's electric you plug it in and I can cook right here on it so let me get this french toast fixed and I'll bring you back okay I'm back all right here's the right here's the first two um, slices and then I've got two in there seems to be working really well um, <laughs> kind of excited about it because it's definitely something that since I don't have a stove in my dining room and I cook in here it's definitely something that um, will be easy make things easier on me and but anyway let me I'm gonna just check out this French toast make sure it's done Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mmm, that's awesome. See, it's cooking it perfectly. And I've got it on five. So you should be able to see that I can use my pan again. I've got a lot of pans that I'll be able to use now. But anyway, I just wanted to bring you into my dining room and show you this and let you see my new little gadget. There it is. And this is a review on it. And I was fixing French toast. And so I hope you like this review. And if you do, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. And if you'd like to be a part of my Facebook group, you can go to www.facebook.com forward slash food prepping, which is one word, F-O-O-D-P-R-E-P-P-I-N-G. And like my page there. You can send me messages on there. You can put recipes on there. You can put anything you want to on there. Um, as long as it's not, you know, anything that shouldn't be on Facebook. So, anyway, you have a good day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.